Let's go, ladies. Let's go. Push it through. Push it through. There we go, ladies. Good. Look at that, baby. Up early. Clocking in. I would like to get to know Good morning, beautiful people. Here we are with Vlogmas episode three. And I just finished virtual boot camp. So I want to show y'all a little footage of me doing virtual boot camp. And virtual boot camp is Mondays and Wednesdays at 6 a.m. and then Wednesday at 12 p.m. This is all in Central Time, y'all. I am located in Houston, Texas. All right. So this is all Central. And if you would like to sign up, I will leave my email below for you to fill, uh, send me an email so I can send you the details to sign up because we would love to have you. The ladies was working hard this morning. It was a little tired, but they pushed through, and that's what matters. They showed up for them. That's what matters. All right, so let's go over what we got to do today, ladies. So today, uh, I got a couple of things to do. So tomorrow I'm leaving to go see Cam tomorrow in Austin. So tomorrow I'll be leaving for Austin. So today I really have three things on my to-do list. So uh, today I need the. I'm finna get ready to go work out. It's right now it's six fifty eight, and um I was gonna start another week of my exercise. I have like a little program that I'm following right now, but I was like, nah, I'm finna be out of town. I want to start it on Friday. We can. I started on Friday with Cam. So today I'm going to be going to a group class at my gym at 8 o'clock, which means I have a whole hour to make me some breakfast. I'm going to hop in the shower because, baby, that work got to be crucial, y'all. Real, real crucial. And then after that, I have a couple of clients. I have, um, let's see, I have a 10, 11, boot camp at 12, and then I have one at 1, and then the best part of the day at 2:45 I have a wax appointment and along with that wax appointment I'm going to be getting a vajayshul. Let me tell y'all ladies if you have not got a vajayshul you literally are missing out. Like it's at like my top list of self-care things because who don't want their little girl pretty? Like you want your little girl gorgeous. You need her prepped up, prime, in good shape. And right now, she ain't in good shape right now, so that's what we're going to do at 2:45. And then after that, I'm going to pack and so that's pretty much what is on the to-do list today for my vlogmas episode today and i'm i'm gonna show also y'all already know i'm gonna show y'all what i'm eating today because that's what i do i want to see i want y'all to know what i'm eating but with that being said let me go hurry up and get ready because it will be eight o'clock before i know it and with school traffic i gotta leave a little bit early so i could be at class on time and i will check back in with y'all in a second all right y'all so breakfast is complete we have let me see that all right, I made potatoes, eggs, and turkey bacon. I made these potatoes last night in the air fryer while I was in the tub because I knew once I got at the tub, I was going to be ready to eat. So, this is what we having for breakfast. And right now, it's 7.19. So, I'm going to eat, eat slowly because I eat fast and it gives me gas. So I'm going to eat slowly and then I'm going to get ready to get dressed to head to class. And I'll clock back in with y'all when I get to class because I really want y'all to meet Miss Nikki, okay? That's the instructor. Beautiful woman, very talented. She's, man, baby, let me tell you. I really think she be trying to send me on home, y'all, because I be dying. But it's a really good push that I be needing because sometimes when your body get used to doing the same stuff, it don't kind of give you that push that you need to reach a higher you, if that makes sense. So I started going to this class to just give me something different to do, give me something to mentally push myself a little harder. And this class definitely does it, okay? So I will clock back in with y'all when I get to the gym, well, when I'm headed to the gym. And let me enjoy this meal. And I'll see y'all. team. So we have just made it to class. It's 7.59. I'm right on time. I'm about to walk in the gym. And depending on if it's music playing or not, I'll let y'all talk to Miss Nikki. But if it's music playing, baby, y'all just going to see Miss Nikki. And that's it because I ain't trying to get copyrighted now. YouTube, be, they be on it. And I'm going to get some footage of me doing the workouts on my phone. It won't be on my camera. I'll get some on my phone. Because, y'all, I ain't going to lie, I be dead. So, when we first go up in there, I got about 15 minutes to just walk on the treadmill, get myself warmed up. I probably go to the restroom like three times just from drinking all this water. And then the 15 class starts. That's when the hell starts, y'all. So, uh, 
cheers to a great workout cheers to a productive workout and cheers to a productive day okay so i clock back in with y'all in a second sec well not a second like an hour or so because class will be over at nine maybe a little bit after nine if she give me abs for my burnout and i don't finish on time because i never finish on time but i make it through and that's what matter all right y'all i will check back in with y'all in a sec because it's eight o'clock let me get in now Hey, how y'all doing? My name is Joshua Wright, and I just want to be uh, relevant in her video right now, so it's me with the Right Way Fitness. Tell me where to find you at, Josh. Oh, you can find me at uh, Altwed and Southmore at the Body Shop. Follow him on Instagram, y'all, the Right Way Fitness. I'll put it below. And I want y'all, Miss Nikki, I know you eating, but I want you to say hello to my YouTube. <laughs> 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 Get it together, Miss Nikki. <laughs> Hello, everybody. Tell them where to follow you at, Miss Nikki. Y'all can follow me at MZ underscore Nicole X. That's Ms. underscore Nicole X. Y'all, that's Miss Nikki. She just killed me today, y'all. <laughs> but I made it. All right, y'all. Clocking out. So, hi, team. So, hold on. Let's get in the light. There goes the light. All right, team. So, Workout is complete. It's now 9.16. My next client is 9 until 10.15, so I got some time to go home and get my shit together, my stuff together, and watch my language. And y'all, oh, excuse me. Today was a little tough. Like, I don't know if, I don't know what it was. Everybody was tired. Today was hard, but I finished. I think the worst part, I did get a footage. Y'all looking at it right now. Look at this footage. This is one of the stations that really made me feel good about myself because... When I first started my journey, burpees was something that I avoided. I said, baby, I'll never do a burpee because I just really didn't think that I could get myself up off the ground. And this is the first time, like, coming to this class helped me really get on, um, getting all the way on the ground and getting all the way back up. And y'all, kind of took me out. I really think it was because I had the bear crawl, bear crawl back, 25 jumper jacks, and then I had to sprint for one minute on 8.5 and then do the battle ropes. It was those three back-to-back -back that took me out. I didn't get enough footage of that because I was ready to get up out there. And then on top of that, y'all, at the end of my workout, I had to do a thousand jump rope. I said, Miss Sneaky, baby, I just learned how to jump rope uh, like three months ago, so I jump rope slow. It took me about five minutes to get 250, but she cut it down to 500. And guess who finished? Your girl did. I finished. I got the 500. She was like, "Baby, doing that?" She was like, "Jump rope like that? You gonna be all day?" I said, "All right, I'm gonna be all day then till I get it right." And I was all day because it's 9:17. Class supposed to be over at nine. But y'all, all right, I'm about to head home, chillax for a little bit. I'm really not hungry. Probably won't eat till later, and then. I'm just super duper chill until it's time for my client to come at 10 15. And I'll check back in with y'all later. I need some chapstick. I need to go wash my face. I need to go do a lot of stuff. I really need to just go sit down. So that's what I'm about to go do, y'all. Clock in later. Right, you guys, we are back. It is now 11:46, and now it is time for virtual boot camp. Virtual boot camp starts at 12. It's gonna be from 12 to 12:45, 12 12:50 12 ish. And then I have one more client until it's time for me to go get my vajasha, y'all. I'm literally so ready to hop in the shower, get fresh, just to go get refreshed. And I want to show y'all this mug I got from Target. Like, this is so cute. When I saw this, I was like, D, kind of my name? Yeah. The weather keep changing, and it's making my allergies mess up. Oh, and I also bought my mom this candle. Okay, it got dark, y'all, because I was in front of my ring light. I bought my mom this candle that she has not burned, so I might steal it and take it in my room. And this is the D candle as well. I thought that was really cute. So it's like the matching cup in the candle from Target, y'all. That was $5 a piece. So yeah, I thought this was so cute because I like to I like to be in the aesthetic sometimes when I be, you know, doing my little self-care day. And I thought that was just so cute. So I grabbed it. And I cannot help but to keep looking over here, y'all. The tree I already full, and it's only December 7th. Now, these are my our PJs that we ran. For Christmas Eve and the tree is full. I remember being a little girl looking under the tree trying to see the name. And look, I already right there. What they say? Two done from mom and dad. That's how you know when you get old when you start saying from mom and dad and not Santa. Because clearly, you know, maybe I sometimes it's so crazy, but sometimes my mama will put on that from Santa. Like, baby, Santa brought them gifts. Stop playing. Let me stop looking under this tree. Oh, this one say to hubby from wifey. This one my daddy, y'all. But yeah. Let me give one of that tree for my mama to get on my 
because she do not be playing about us being under the tree. So now at the virtual boot camp, I will clock back in with y'all later. I did just drink um, some of my lemon. I did just drink some of my lemon ginger tea to help with my bloating, y'all, because the bloating has been out of control. I've really been trying to pay attention to... I've been putting on so much chapstick. I've really been trying to pay attention to what I'm eating that's causing my stomach to get super duper gassy, and I still have not figured it out. So I've been... Um, I saw this recommendation to keep a food log, and to write down how you feel after you eat, and I should have started today, but I didn't. But I'm for sure going to start Monday so I can start noticing and recognizing some of the uh foods that are making me a little gassy so while um while i was away i was working on a program y'all so if you do not know i make custom workout programs for like my people that are not able to come in person and right now i'm working on a six-week full body gym based program uh for one of my customers and i'm almost complete i just gotta add some of the links I'll show y'all how it looks. Not the exercise, but I'll show y'all how it looks. Pretty much, yeah. So, these are all the instructions and different stuff like that. Materials, daily warm-up, and then here goes the workouts. So, yeah, that's what I'm working on. And then I just have to add the links in. So, right now, I got 10 minutes until game time. And my twist is coming out. So, I have to fix that, y'all. I thought my hair was going to last to Christmas, but it ain't looking like it. And I really hope that it's called on Christmas because I really want to get a silk press. I want my hair flat on so bad. So if I don't get my hair flat on, I want some weave or something. Something different, y'all. I'm, I'm tired of the, the same old, same old, baby. All right, y'all. I'm going to clock back in with y'all in a second. And if you're still watching right now and you have not subscribed, go ahead and subscribe. And I'll be back to mess with y'all in a little bit. Y'all, last client until boot camp. I'm talking about boot, boot camp. Until boot camp is complete. Now it's time for me to eat, y'all, because I'm starving. I was going to take a bath first because it's almost time for my wax appointment. But I was like, babe, I can't wait. I need it now. Like, I need food now. I have not ate. I did have a little oatmeal and some lemon ginger tea earlier. But that was about it. Now, I'm starving. All right, y'all, so I made it to my appointment, and it's 2.30, so I got about 15 minutes. I ain't do my edges. I really don't be putting on no lotion because when I get in there, my nerves get so bad, I get to sweating. You would think that this is my first time, but I sweat every time, y'all. I didn't do my edges, but I'm going to go back home and get fixed up before boot camp start. And when I get home, uh, I'm going to show y'all a couple of my Fashion Nova jeans that are my favorite. Like, I just tried out Fashion Nova jeans. So, I'm going to show y'all a couple of those. And then, after that, it's going to be time for me to finish packing. So, I will be ending this vlog real soon. So, I didn't want this vlog to be super duper long. But, I kind of just want to let y'all see, like, how, what I do in between my clients. And how I really just manage my time and still get what I need to get done, you know, throughout the day. So, when I get home, I'll show y'all a couple of things that I'm going to be packing with me and go over I hold a little run through of what we doing, what we get when I get to Austin tomorrow. And I will be doing more Vlogmas when I get to Cam. So be ready for that. He's already super excited. We, like I said, we got a whole rundown of what we doing. So I will keep y'all updated on that. And without further ado, let's get to this wax appointment. You don't really get no better over time. It still be a little hard. So I was like, nah. But I did get a couple of footage. And I did want y'all to see the salon as well. So, yep. I'm headed home to start packing. It is now 3.34. Which means I got a little bit more time till it's time for me to teach boot camp. Which is at 6.30. I start getting ready for that at like 5.45. So, I'm going to go home. Show me y'all some of my little fashion over face. And then, 
yeah that's what we got planned for the rest of this vlog all right y'all so i made it back home and before i came home i did make a quick stop by walgreens because you know i always gotta have your toiletries y'all i just got on i threw on anything and so i did buy some new deodorant see this deodorant i used to use a long time ago let's let it focus let's look larry can y'all see that yeah, let's scoot it up. It is the Clean Lavender Secret, y'all. So this one, I used to use this a long time ago. But then when I started my weight loss journey, like all of a sudden, some changed. And then I also noticed that anytime it's almost time for my cycle to come, like my deodorant just all of a sudden stopped working. Like I don't be musty, but it don't be that clean and fresh smell that I'm used to. Because the deodorant that I was using was this one. All spice, uh, it's such a glow. All spice, Fiji. But if you don't know, it was just a recall on this because it was cancerous. So I seen it and I told my cousin, but I said, Babe, I'm not worried about that. Then I was in the store and I seen this uh, older man and he was like, I thought I was finna, he was like, I need to make a return. He told me, I thought I was finna be smelling good. Then I seen it on the TV. I was like, okay, that'd be maybe anything about something new. So we're gonna try this out and see. How this is the gel kind. I really don't even like wearing the gel because it get on my clothes. But the solid sometimes just don't do it for me. And I remember I used to use this. And they had a sale. First of all, let me tell y'all how ghetto it is. Well, let me just tell y'all how I know I stay in the hood. Because as y'all can see by this video, everything is locked up. You can't even run in the store real quick. Get what you need because everything is locked up. You calling for assistance. You want to know why? Because people are always stealing. That's why. People are always stealing. So, I waited for about five minutes to finally get this soap. They didn't have the one that I like. I usually use the Gentle Exfoliating, and they did not have it. Because I only use Dove. So, I got the Sensitive Skin one. So, this is you. Let it focus. This is usually what I use. Um, and then, when I want a little smell, I put the Gentle Exfoliating one on top of it. But this one, I just got the Dove Original one. The blue color one. Y'all know the Gentle Exfoliating is kind of light blue. So, I just got an Apex this. And... For y'all that have been asking what I use for uh, my face, this is what I've been using. This right here is what I've been using. It's what I always use. I don't switch up. Just for the simple fact that my skin is super duper sensitive and I don't be having time. And lately, my aquifer has not been working on my lips. Every time I look up, I'm putting some on. I don't know if it's just because I lick my lips a lot or what. I know I'm not dehydrated because all I do is drink water, so... That's what I'm not understanding. So, I bought this EOS uh, Vanilla Bean. And then I got this uh, Vaseline Cocoa Butter. So, if y'all have any recommendations when it comes to lip products that really, really work and really, really stay on good enough, please let me know. So, alright. Enough of that. Let's go to the to-do list so we can see uh, what... What type of outfits that I will need. Okay, let's read it down to you. And, of course, I'm going to go over it again when y'all watch the next vlog. So, let's find Cam. All right. So, this is the rundown. All right. So, Thursday. So, I get in Thursday. Maybe around 11, 12. Depends on how early I wake up. I get in 11, 12. And so, at, on Thursday night, we have dinner with Annie and Hannah. So, that has to be something fancy. And then, we all go to the W to see Amy's apartment. Y'all, I cannot wait to show y'all Amy's apartment. Uh, apartment. Amy's is, Amy is Annie's mom. And y'all will meet them as well. And then, Hannah is Annie's, fr Annie's friend. Too many A's. Okay, and then, Friday, Jim, of course. Uh, Jim, Jim time with me and Kim. And then, he has my Christmas gift. We have to be there for one thirty. And then Friday night, we're going to dinner with his Amy. And then Saturday, we got the 5K race. So what we is, we run the 5K. And then after that, we go to have a, a family time. We have family time. I think my, I think my, I think my camera about to die, y'all. I know you lying. All right, y'all, I'm back. That was a technical difficulty. Okay, so like I was saying, so we have a couple things planned. So really, I need two workout outfits, maybe two chill outfits. Really, when I'm a chill in Thursday, I'm a well on the way down there because I'm going to take a bath in the morning. It's going to be fresh on the way down there. And then, so 
first i know one of my chill outfits is gonna be this uh i got this from it's like a little half crop top and then the bottoms i really do not like wearing white light colors because it's really not my colors i like nudes so i also have a um a brown i also have like a brown warmer suit uh if i'm not mistaken i can't believe i can't remember what school let's say on that let me go grab it real quick let's grab it real quick Yeah, so I also have this one as well. This is the UCLA one. So I might bring this one as well. Like, this is more of my color than a light one. But I like this one because it is a crop and then I can wear like a white tank top underneath. So I really like that. And then for dinner, I wore this outfit already, but I really want to wear it again. I really wanted to order a pretty dress, but my mind was so many places this week. I, I have forgot to order something because I was going to just get it sent to Cam House, but my mind was too many places. So didn't do that. So, I have this, like, bodysuit. So, really, y'all, that's the only two places I shop at. Fashion Nova and H&M for now. I did try Pretty Little Thing, but the stuff that I did order was way too big. So, if I was to order there again, I just know I have to go down a size. And I also have this really cute brown see-through bodysuit that I probably will wear over this. I just got to look for it, y'all. I be buying so much stuff, I don't be knowing where to put it. So, this kind of how it is. It's like, it go across the shoulder, and then it's right right here, and then it's all in. So that's one of the tops that I have. And so, y'all, these are the jeans. The other jeans that I was going to show y'all, they're in the washer. So these are really just some plain jeans. So I got my Fashion Nova jeans in the 13. Just because most like I probably could have fit 11, but I like my pants to come over my stomach. A lot of people be talking about, baby, stomach don't belong in jeans, stomach don't belong in tights. Baby, stomach belong wherever done wanted to belong. Okay? okay. So I got these jeans, and I got some black ones, of course. I wonder if these have rips in them. No, these all just plain, plain, these plain as well, uh, 13 as well. And then, oh, these are the ones that I cannot wait to wear. These are ripped, child. It's like the booty, like the booty, it's ripped like at the booty cheek right here. Love that. And so, yeah, and it's on both sides. And so, the other ones I have is ripped at the knee. And then, yeah. So, I'm really trying to decide on what I want to do because uh, I don't, I don't think I have a dress that I probably could wear. I'm trying to think, y'all. I be having so much stuff. I do have a turtleneck. I need some more clothes. I really, really, really need some more clothes. And then I don't even know what, what the weather looking like. But so far, y'all, that's what I'm packing. My jeans. And then I'm going to find this other top. I really want... Let me see what I got up in here. Y'all, I cannot find that top. It really, really, I'm tripped out because, okay, so, and if I wear these, I'm most likely going to wear some strappy heels. Let me show you how the strappy heels. I got these from Fashion Nova as well. These right here, I want to wear these because I have never wore these. I think I wore them maybe once. Nah, I don't think I ever wore these because y'all, whether y'all believe it or not, I cannot walk in heels. And I have some brown ones that's very similar to these. And they kind of like uh, from H&M. And I, yeah, I have not wore those. And I'm trying to see what tennis shoes I will wear with this. I'm thinking... I don't know, because I'm more of a type of, like, throwing my vans and call it a day type of girl. Like, that's the type of stuff that I do. But, y'all, on some real stuff, I've really been trying to find out my style. Because I will work out clothes so much to the point where when it comes time to dress up, I'm typical. Either, like, a nice, cute dress, a two-piece set, um, bodysuit and jeans, shirt and jeans, something simple. But I really haven't just tapped into, you know, my style or whatever like that. And what time is it? So it's almost 4.47. It's almost, I got like an hour to start packing up. Because I don't know if it's just me. But I'll pack up like 50 drawers. 50 pair of panties. And that's just what I do. Because I be needing a lot. I really want to find that shirt, y'all. Hold on, let me look at it. Y'all, I found this. So, this is not the shirt. But I will definitely wear this shirt. It's like a crop top. H&M, y'all. It's like a crop top long sleeve with these uh, H&M pants that I bought. So, like I told y'all, very, very simple. And they just say... 
um, original on them, those pants. Oh, yikes. Technical difficulties, y'all. And so then the last thing, this is the shirt, y'all. I kid you not, y'all. This shirt looked so much butter on the lady on Fashion Nova. Like, I be feeling like Fashion Nova be, mm -hmm. So this is, it's like a turtleneck and then it's like see-through. I also thought that would be cute. I'm trying to see if it's really see-through. Because I got a black bra that I could wear. This would be cute as well. Like something different and sexy. And then I probably would still probably wear the black shoes. Or I do have some clear heels. I could wear some clear heels with that. But y'all, like I said, I'm working on my style. I'm going to have to go through more of my clothes. Because I want to I wanna have stuff that can be worn without a jacket. And just in case it hot off and get hot. Because the weather's so up and down. Like, let me check the weather. weather in austin like now it's 77 thursday supposed to be high 80s friday high 80s saturday cool and then sunday ciao done i got work to do y'all i really really got work to do so that's pretty much it. I just wanted to show y'all a couple of things that I was going to choose from a pack. And most likely, I'm going to bring all that just so I can have some suggestions, some options. I mean, I need to have options on what I want to choose from. But if all else fails, I have plenty of crop tops that I could wear. Like a lot of... Let me show y'all. Yeah, so I really... I would definitely wear this. I got this crop top. This is my style, y'all. I'll throw a crop top on with anything this is this is the color so y'all can really see it's like kind of like a nudish off white and then i have this shirt as well something cute off white and then this shirt back out baby i love me a back out shirt ever since i got my tattoo on my back i don't know if y'all seen it wait let's see <sighs> I hope y'all able to see that. So it's like two butterflies. And I really want to get another one. And so y'all got a lot of shirts like that. And I also got like this little brown where they kind of like cross over. So then I can see my other tattoo. Y'all, yeah, this is my other tattoo. Boop. So yeah, that one as well. So, alright y'all. I done did enough talking to y'all. I'm probably finna go grab me some ice cream. Chill for a little bit. Start getting my stuff together. And then I'm really gonna throw everything in the bag uh tonight before i head to bed because i'm going to bed early because i have not made this this drive in so long and i always get sleepy on the road and that's not what we want y'all so with that being said i hope y'all enjoyed this video i'm just trying to give y'all a little bit more into my lifestyle but like i said y'all i'm pretty basic i don't really be doing nothing but with that being said y'all already know the drill come back and mess with your girl next time on vlogmas y'all be seeing cam so be have your notifications on don't forget to subscribe and get ready for this next episode and with that being said peace out